Hey guys, I'm Dan and welcome to a brand new video and today I'm super excited to be showing you this really fantastic pack of 15 mini dinos from Hasbro. I got this pack from eBay and I'm super excited, I can't wait to show you guys, okay? So in this video, I'm gonna open this pack up and we are going to have a comparison with the Connecte Mini Dino, okay? So let's get this pack open up now, okay? So let's have a closer look at this really, really awesome packaging, okay? So on the front cover, you have this really nice picture of a T-Rex with the mouth wide open. And of course, we have the, um, the three Velociraptors, um, actually only two, um, and a Stegosaurus over here. And what is this? A Triceratops, okay? So here you have this really cool sticker of um, a Walmart exclusive sticker over here and uh, of course nice Jurassic World logo it says exclusive Indominus Rex included okay so this is really awesome at the back of the pack you have some information about the toys so let's get started okay let's cut this pack open up cutting this along the dotted line Awesome, okay, so let's get this pack open. Oh, I didn't manage to cut the opening, so I'm gonna try again. Okay, I have finally got it open, so wow. Let's have a look now, okay? So the first one over here, Let's see how we can get this guy out. Wow, so the first figure we got is the Indominus Rex. So let's have a look at this. Really, really awesome, okay? So this portion over here is actually blue in color. I'm not too sure why they painted this in blue. Hmm, okay. So you have the JW logo on the right side of the leg. So that's pretty cool. It says um 2015 Hasbro. Okay, so we have the Indominus Rex, okay. So let's move on with the next one. It's hard to stand this guy because the feet, you know, both legs are really small. So I'm just gonna place it right over here. Really stand this guy well. And the next one, what is this? Let's get this guy up from his cage. We have a Spinosaurus, and this Spinosaurus is in grey with some really nice green paint over the top. So let's have a size comparison between these two. Hmm. It is almost the same size. I believe the Indominus Rex should be slightly bigger than um, the Spinosaurus. And the next one, what do we have here? A Velociraptor. Okay, so let's get this guy up from his cage. In which Velociraptor is this? I'm not too sure. Possibly, I think this might be blue so I'm gonna place it right here and move on with the next one okay so what do we have here looks like we have a pachycephalosaurus so let's have a look a brown pachycephalosaurus with some nice red paint okay, let's have a closer look not the most detailed figurines I would say you know, these are actually very limited edition figurines. So I'm still very happy with them. Can't really stand this guy at all. Okay. The next one. A Mosasaurus, okay. I think I have a Mosasaurus, but this is definitely, you know, a different one because of its different paint. Okay, so we have a brown Mosasaurus with some nice green paint. 
Okay. The next one. Let's see. What is this? A T-Rex. This is definitely a T-Rex. Let me get it out from its cage. So we have a green T-Rex. Okay. The JW sign. Okay. Can't stand this guy at all. Okay, just gonna leave it lying down. And the next one, what do we have here? A stegosaurus. A green stegosaurus. The four spikes at the back looks a little bit too long for my liking to be honest with you. And this green stegosaurus is looking really muscular. Check out those muscles. And um, it has actually really, really huge plates, okay? And um, the next one I'm gonna show you. Okay, this one looks pretty awesome. It's a Triceratops. Okay. I don't remember seeing Triceratops in Jurassic World movie. I'm not too sure, I can't really remember. So we have a green Triceratops, I'll place it right over here. I'm gonna adjust the camera now so that you can you guys can see the figurines more clearly. Okay. What is this one over here? Let me open this up, okay. This one over here looks like a um I'm not too sure. This one could be a Dilophosaurus. I'm not too sure. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. This green Dilophosaurus seems to have some really nice stripes. But I'm not too sure whether this is an you know, I'm not too sure whether this is a Dilophosaurus. Totally not sure. Wow, looks like we have another Stegosaurus and this one is a different paint. This one is actually brown in color with some really um, defining grey plates at the top. It's totally different from this, I mean the colors, but the mold is exactly the same. But somehow this brown Stegosaurus looks slightly bigger, I'm not too sure. Okay, and the next one, what do we have here? Another Mosasaurus, okay, this Mosasaurus is the one which I already have, okay. So as compared to this, you know, I'll definitely prefer this one over here. And the next one, let's see, a Pteranodon, okay, a Pteranodon, a green Pteranodon. Okay, we actually have another one over here, this is actually a Dimorphodon, a brown Dimorphodon with some blue spots. Check out those muscles, okay. Let's see what else we have here inside the pack. What is this? Another Dilophosaurus? Exactly the same, okay. So we have two, not this one. We have two exactly the same inside Lophosaurus, okay. Looks like we are left with just one. Let's see what's this, okay. This one over here, it's a an Ankylosaurus, okay. This one looks pretty cool, I would say. There's only one color. To this figurine over here. So yes, these are all the 15 dinos in this pack. So we have a Dimorphodon, um, two Dilophosaurus, one Triceratops, a Pachycephalosaurus, okay, two Stegosaurus, two Mosasaurus, only one Velociraptor. I don't know why. One Spinosaurus, and 
one. Indominus Rex, this one is definitely my favorite one. So this war this figurine, I'm gonna review it again in um my next video. The next video which I'm gonna make will be an Indominus Rex collection movie. So I'm pretty excited. Okay, right now I'm gonna show you collecting mini figurines and these are really awesome okay i'm gonna make space for um collecting mini figurines and we can have a comparison okay? to be honest with you based on details and the paint job i would say the collecting dinos they look better for sure but you know you guys might think otherwise so let's have a look at the collecting figurines now okay so this collecting figurines they actually come with um, this really nice casing so let's open this box up okay like this it comes with a leaflet okay so let's have a look at the leaflet so you get the baryonyx triceratops stegosaurus so these are all the figurines you can get from not exactly all of them but you will get some of these figurines inside this box okay so let's see what do we have here so the first one over here we have it's a diplodocus okay check this out okay this figurine is actually very very small but it's actually super detailed okay if you compare with um, stegosaurus over here you can see some really fine details on the diplodocus okay so this one looks really really cool place it in front like this okay this is actually a diplodocus standing on its hind leg really. hind leg sorry so the next one we have it's a triceratops okay this one over here it's not really that nice as compared to the diplodocus i would say so let's move on but i love this one okay this mosasaurus here is really really awesome Okay, I feel this is definitely better than the Jurassic World. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. Okay, let's see. Okay, the next one. We have a Baryonyx. Okay, this one looks pretty cool. And of course, we have a Feathered T-Rex. And this one is actually one of my favorite mini figures. Okay feather t-rex so let's have a comparison okay this t-rex definitely is um, created after the movie and this one is a feather t-rex so they look you know almost you know, exactly different from each other okay I would say I would go with this one again feather t-rex stegosaurus I don't think there's any contest between this and this this is actually way more detailed as compared to um, the Jurassic World this one looks really awesome I love you know the details and the paint on the plates and in terms of um, accuracy I would say um, this one is definitely much more accurate as you guys can see the four spikes over here they are actually of the right length as compared to the Stegosaurus um, from Jurassic World spikes over here are so long and, and the plates are like too huge for my liking I'm not too sure next I'm gonna show you this one okay and this pteranodon from Collecte is really really awesome I love how the, you know, they made the wings slightly translucent as you guys can see as I move my um, fingers behind the wings it's really nice a, a nice touch to it and take a look at all those um, texturing they did on the wings really awesome next one what is this I don't think this is oh this is a Cantrosaurus okay I would say this one is um, um, it's not as pretty as compared to the Stegosaurus here for sure this is actually much smaller and um what do we have here the pachycephalosaurus and let's have a comparison with the jurassic world mm, in terms of accuracy 
I would say this one over the Collecte is better. Um, but I would prefer the you know the posture of this um, the one from Jurassic World. I don't really like you know dinosaur models with base, so I would prefer this one over here. And the last one we have it's a Parasaurolophus from Collecte, and it looks pretty awesome. So these are all the mini figures that I have shown you today. They are really awesome. So some of them are from Jurassic World Mini Dinos and some of them are from Collecte. So let's have another recap. So which one is your favorite? Let me know in the comment section below. So my favorite one would definitely be Indominus Rex, okay? Because, you know, I really love the Indominus Rex, okay? The figure in terms of details and paintwork can be way better. Um, yeah, so we have you know, like herbivorous dinosaurs like Triceratops, Diplodocus, Stegosaurus, Kendrosaurus, and Kylosaurus. Okay, so they look super awesome. So which one is your favorite? Let me know down in the comments. And thanks for watching this. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. You know, share it. Leave me a comment. You guys know I read every single one of your comments. Okay, um, and I try to reply to each and every one of you. So I hope you guys enjoy this and I'll see you tomorrow in the next video. Goodbye.